ஹை ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் திஸ் இஸ் திருலோச்சன் வெல்கம் டு மை யூடியூப் சேனல் ஜவாப் பை திருலோச்சன் இன் திஸ் வெடியோ ஐ வில் ஷோ யூ ஹவு டு கன்ஃபிக் யுவர் அப்பாச்சி டம்கேட் இன் எக்லிப்ஸ் என்வாரன்மெண்ட் ஸோ ஆஸ் வி நோ அக்பாச்சி டம்கேட் இஸ் ஏ வெப் சர்வர் அண்ட் த வெப் சர்வர் இஸ் ரெஸ்பான்சிபிள் டு எக்ஸிக்யூட் எனி ஜவாப் பேஸ்ட் வெப் அப்ளிகேஷன்ஸ் ஸோ ஹியர் ஐ வில் ஷோ யூ ஹவு டு டவுன்லோட் அப்பாச்சி டம்கேட் and uh, how to configure in eclipse environment so uh, first of all if i will go to in google and i will type apache tomcat apache tomcat so now i will uh, click in apache tomcat and you see and i will f- uh, go through the apache tomcat official website you see there are uh, many versions so latest version is tomcat 10 so but i uh, we will install tomcat 9 because uh, tomcat 9 uh, is very compatible so if i will click uh, apache tomcat 9 now i will download so you see uh, this is the file so where is my cursor i hope it is visible so now i will download uh, apache tomcat the version is 9 so now i will click here now uh, within a very few second it will download so apache tomcat uh, is downloading so once uh, i will uh, download apache tomcat uh, zip file i will get now i will go to my download option so here i will go to my download option you see apache tomcat uh, downloaded so now i will copy so i will so i will i will copy uh, this uh, apache tomcat and uh, i will keep in a folder <coughs> suppose in my d drive so i have a folder java software folder suppose i will here i will so i will uh, what uh, keep apache tomcat folder and uh, this now i will this is a zip file now i will extract now this is a zip file that i will extract here so now uh, apache tomcat so basically it is a web server it is an application developed by apache software foundation so the basically it is a web server this server is responsible to execute any web application so apache tomcat is responsible to execute any java based web application so now i uh, what uh, extracted apache tomcat so now i uh, what uh, kept apache tomcat uh, what uh, in d drive inside the d drive i have a folder java software folder in my java software folder i kept apache tomcat now i will go to my eclipse environment so now this is my eclipse environment now i will bring i will bring apache tomcat into my eclipse environment okay so now you will see there is an window option so i will show you what is the procedure what is the step by step procedure uh, how to configure apache tomcat because this is the very uh, basic concept that uh, we have to do so if i will execute any uh, servlet application any jsp application any java based web application so i have to configure apache tomcat because apache tomcat uh, is the web server which is responsible to execute web application you see now there is this is my eclipse environment and these are the menu bar so i will go to window so window option and there is an option preferences now i click you see there is an option server so here so there is an option server i am entering into the server option there is an option run time environment now i will click so then i will click on add option then uh, so there are so many apache tomcat version displaying so which version that uh, i will select so tomcat 9 i have downloaded i have kept so which version that you have downloaded and kept that version you have to choose so i have downloaded apache tomcat 9.0 version so i definitely i will choose i have apache tomcat 9.0 then i will click on next button then uh, i will click on browse option so browse means in which location that uh, we have 
kept apache tomcat so that exact uh, path we have to fetch so now i have uh, kept in date drive then i uh, i have kept in my in date drive in a java software folders then you see there is this is my apache tomcat folder you see this is my apache tomcat software so in bin uh, this is the, this is in just to see so where is my cursor so this is bin this is apache tomcat now i have selected now i will click on select folder then this is the path that i specified through browsing then i will click on finish button then i will click on apply and close button okay so this is the step number 1 so i specified in which path i have kept apache tomcat so i retrieved now this is my project explorer bar this is my project explorer bar in my eclipse environment so now till now the server have not come uh, into our environment you see so there is a link so there is a so there are here so many options markers properties servers data source explorer snippet so you so go to servers you see so uh, a link is displaying uh, so a link is displaying no servers are av available click this link to create a new server so now i will click on this link and you see there is an option next option you click then i will click on finish button so you see so in project explorer bar so an option is coming to our picture so this is server okay so now this is the apache tomcat server configuration so in this way we will configure apache tomcat server because this is the step number 1 this is the first step to configure apache tomcat into our eclipse environment then we will develop a java based web application then we will execute java based web application so who is responsible apache tomcat is responsible to execute java based web applications so i hope uh, everybody got clarity and everybody uh, will enjoy with this video guys if everybody will uh, what uh, uh, end with this video and please uh, don't forget to like share and subscribe our channel and press the bell button for getting more and more updates thank you